What up, what up, what up? What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Jess. Welcome back to another Madden 25 franchise gameplay. And today, we are going up against the Rams of St. Louis. Week 14 is in your face. Uh, <coughs> at the end of the video, guys, my t shirt shop is finally, finally open. The guy who was doing the designs finally finished them. I got like, I don't know, stuff that don't make no sense just because the website allows you to do it. I think it's pretty cool. I doubt I'm ever going to sell any, but <laughs> I got like onesies, mugs, I'm working on toilet paper, all that stuff. I <laughs> uh, got some t-shirts, which I actually bought one myself, which I can't wait. It does suck that you got to buy your own t-shirt though, right? Because I had to spend a good amount on these designs. You know, the guy who did them. I uh, had to pay him for him, and it's a firm move. And look at Patrick Willis scooping up the concentration. It's a gravitational force. The ball is a gravitational force with his, and it can go all the way. Look at my man Pat Willis taking it all the way to the end zone. Style on him, Pat, one time. That man is an absolute monster in this game. He is always around the ball. The dude is just astronomically biblical, people. Astronomically biblical. Uh, so like I was saying about the shirts, man, um, sucks, right? I had to buy my own shirt, man. It's coming soon. I can't wait. I got to, I'm bringing the lumber shirt. Yo, that design is so off the hook. Um, so we got a, it's it, we got, give it to me, baby. We got, I'm bringing the lumber. We got no of you. And we got, uh, don't test that either. So shirts are pretty cool, man. I'm going to show you guys an example of that stuff at the end of the video. Um, I'm excited, man, to finally have it. Uh, like I said, it's going to take me like 317 shirts <laughs> in order to sell, in order to make my money back. But um, I'm just glad that it's finally here. I finally have a t-shirt shop. People have been asking me for years to finally get some GS certified apparel. And now it's here. Like I said, at the end of the video, man, go on ahead and uh, check it out. I'm excited, man. I uh, So far, there's been 10 sales. Well, 9. 1 was myself. There's been 9 sales total. And I'm excited, man. I'm so excited. Anyways, back into this gameplay, man. Back into this gameplay right there. We fast forward a little bit during the drive. Kaepernick, he's looking, he's looking. Nobody's all right up top. And it's an interception. That made Kaepernick threw a dot. Problem is he threw it to the wrong team. So right here, man, we have Dalton right here. Hopefully, we're going ahead and stop him. Third and ten. He backs up on his shotgun. He throws. Right. Oh, man. There is that man. Pat Willis breaking bones. That man is scary. If he looks at you, you're going to be out two to three weeks. Because his looks are killing. the devastating. He even looks hard. Right there we go. Whoop! Nice outside corner right there to Butler. I mean, Austin. Excuse me. Austin had a hell of a game. And I mean a hell of a game, man. Right here really quick. Whoa! Oh! Oh! Oh, look at my man Tavon with the... With the bag juke, you know what I'm saying? He was doing 65 in a 50 mile per hour lane, and they just stopped on him one time, and they didn't know what to do. And we end up scoring right there. That right there was big. Going up 14 to 7. Hopefully, we can continue this and, uh, you know, try to put the pressure on Dalton, try to make him feel uncomfortable inside that pocket. Uh, right here, he tried to roll out, and we get a nice covered sack right there. I believe that was Kerrigan. Third and five, he tried to sneak in and run. Try to sneak we were having no 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 we were having none of that so here we go 14 to 7 with a little uh you know less than a minute and a half right here hopefully we can go down field drive you know hopefully be able to get a touchdown we get ball to have and everything could possibly be game right there was wide open and Kaepernick just completely misses the throw second down we back up and quick inside streak with that right there was dropped so third and ten let's see if we can continue the drive we back up and we throw an absolute dot to Butler right there in the outside shoulder. And right there, just <laughs> we break a sack, but then we end up getting sacked anyways. Second and forever, we back up. Out route to Austin, and he drops the pass. And that right there uh, stopped us from getting that first down. So we're forced to punt the ball. They don't have too much time left, you know, just a, a handful of seconds, you know, about 40 of them. So hopefully we can just... Oh, man, damn, huh? You're just going to get punched in the face like that? In the face. Right here, they hit me with a screen play. And uh, then he hits me with a nice little double juke. And uh, right now they are in field goal territory. He backs up and we uh, are not allowed to get the pass off. So second down right here. Dalton, he's looking for a receiver. Just a really quick crossing route. And we end up getting a big hit. Now they have one timeout remaining. 10 seconds. That right there is the definition of a dot, people. Corner route towards the right side and beautiful. We all know how GS defense is before half. I don't know what is my defense is AS anyways. 
But when it comes before halftime, it's extra ass. You know what I'm saying? When you come on the field, when you play me in Madden, damn, yo, this guy, whoop, nice little double juke, he's a nurse, son. As soon as you play me, damn, the, the guy I'm playing against, his, 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 is that ass? Like, yo, his defense is ass. Like, I can smell it. But when halftime is approaching and you got the ball against me, oh, what is it? It's extra ass. Yo, my defensive awareness turns up to that of a French fry whenever I, it, I'm on defense before half. I don't know what it is, man. It's irrefutable evidence. It's statistically proven. If you got the ball before halftime with enough time, I'm not saying you got the ball with three seconds left on your own three-yard line. No, you know, no, no. But if you got the ball with enough time, you're going to be able to score on me. I don't know what it is. So right here, man, crucial third down. We go uh, to Des Bryant right there. Makes his first showing of the game right here. We look at Kaepernick stats. Close to 200 yards, one TD, one interception. Right, we go to the big man, Gronk, and he looks like he's rumbling, bumbling, stumbling all the way for the first down. He is injured, but thankfully, man, it's nothing serious. He ends up coming back in the game, which is crucial. He's definitely one of my uh, best targets, and I need him. Second down and 10 right here. Let's see if we can go on ahead and uh, make something happen. We back up, and we go over the middle of the big old Gronk. Um, also, man, I want to thank everybody who came to that 24-hour live stream the other day um actually i didn't make it all the way i streamed 20 hours at four o'clock in the morning i fell asleep i was literally falling asleep while playing i just couldn't handle it i was too tired um but we hit over a thousand people at one time man which is amazing we are getting so much love from streaming and i was so tired that's why there was no videos yesterday like i was done i slept most of the day i was tired man uh, i streamed out last i even cursed a couple times during the stream i didn't mean to i didn't mean to. like that game is scary yo I don't do scary. I'm a grown ass me. I don't do scary. You know what I'm saying? Like at night where things are just popping out of nowhere, it freaked me out. I'm like, oh, snap. And I didn't say snap. I wish I did. I cursed a couple times. I didn't mean to. It just frightened me like out of nowhere. That game is crazy, man. I've been playing that on live stream. People have been loving it. Um, as well as Madden, of course, and uh, all that fun stuff. So, uh, you know, it went pretty well. Shout out to everybody who went ahead and um, came through to uh, that live stream link is in the description if you guys would like to see these games played live also in the description is the t-shirt shop man go ahead and check this stuff out right there we got Tavon also on the one-on-one -on -one. and don't do it to him you full of nuts on the same team that drafted you in real life that's how you can do them rims you gonna shimmy on them rims uh, 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 uh. shimmy on them shimmy on them uh really quickly again man what did you guys think of that dunk contest yesterday man i thought it was ass man that dunk contest reminded me of my defense before halftime man just ass <laughs> like um there was only like six dunks, man. It was I thought it was booty, man. I was watching it really. Like that's it, that's it. The show's over. That's it. Like I just I just got here. Like that's it. No more. I seen two dunks in a layup and no more. That's it. Dunk contest is done. I didn't like the new format whatsoever. I, I thought it sucked. I, uh, man, to bring it back to the old school. You know, three three dunks around or however it was. I don't know what the format was. I think it was like three dunks around or whatever. You know, everybody in the same round. Everybody being judged. And, you know, uh, you move on to the next round, things like that. That way you see a handful of dunks. you only seen a couple, man. It would suck. Right there, we throw an interception. I thought I had Gronk um, towards the corner of the end zone. Wrong. Right there, we get a huge sack by Willis. And then we get another sack by Elam. You know what's crazy, yo? Because I blitz a lot, right? You got to. In order to be somewhat successful against the computer and all Madden, you can't sit in coverage, D, because they will tear you apart. You got to send a blitz and hope it gets there in time. Majority of the time, they block it. They pick it up, right? Um, <clears throat> it's a fumble. And I'm thinking to myself, you got to be kidding me, man. Now they get another opportunity. See, that's the all Madden BS. Um, you got to go on ahead and, you know, send pressure and hope you get there. Like right there, see, I sent like eight, but they picked everybody up. You know what I mean? Patrick Willis has, I think, like 30 sacks, yo. I send him on a blitz. He is, his pursuit angle, he's a 99 overall. He's like a damn, he's a mutt player. He's like Lawrence Taylor out there. His pursuit angle is amazing. His block shed is amazing. Like, I'll just send him on a blitz, and he just wrecks havoc. Like, that dude is a monster in this game, yo. The, I don't know what the record is for sacks, but it can't be nowhere near 30 or something like that. Isn't, um, doesn't it belong to, uh, what's his face? Uh, Michael Strahan, or maybe somebody broke it. I don't know. I don't keep up with records or nothing like that, man. But I know... I know Willis got like 31 sacks, yo, which is crazy. Like I said, I'll just put him on a blitz, yo, and he'll just come right through. Like, you know, somebody block him, he'll just throw them out the way and get to the QB. It's crazy. So I'm um, right here, man. Uh, they still have an opportunity. No timeouts, but 
All they need is a touchdown to be able to go ahead and win this game. Right there, we get a huge sack by uh, Kerrigan, forcing a fourth down and 10. Right there, he throws like a three-yard route. And that right there is the end of the game, guys. We end up winning. So, hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay, man. As always, your boy GS, man. Love each and every single one of you guys. Uh, we're going to go on ahead and jump to uh, my t-shirt shop, man. Like I said, I'm really, really excited, man. Now, I know that uh, people have been asking this for a long, long time. And it's, it's finally here. And I'm really, really excited. Like I said... I already sold more than I thought I would have. You know what I mean? I already got uh, nine in the books, which I thought would never happen. So um, we're going to go on ahead and show you my t-shirt shop, man. Here we go, yo. Uh, here we go, yo. All right, guys. Here we are looking at the t-shirt shop. You guys should see on the bottom of your screen. That's the uh, the URL. Link is also in the description. We got a couple of shirts, man. We got some long sleeves now. I'm looking at the price. Don't worry. I know they're like they seem a little pricey. But that's everybody's price because the website, they handle everything. I literally make a couple of dollars for each shirt sold. You know what I mean? So it's not like I'm out here, $30 goes in my pocket. No, I get, I think, like 2 to $3 per item sold. Um, <clears throat> they, the website, they get everything else because they manufacture it. They ship. They handle everything. All I do is handle the traffic to the site. You know what I mean? I try my best to you know try and get some sales. If people want some GS certified apparel. So uh, right here, the T-shirts, man, twenty-five bucks. Um, like I said, I gotta. I'm bringing the lumber shirt, which I think is so off the hook. Look at that design. Though. You don't even gotta say no. You go to the club, and you just look at a girl like, yeah, yeah. Just, just look at my chest. I'm bringing the lumber. That way she know it's going down. So um, if any of you guys are wanting to go on ahead and check out this website, man, please do. Link is in the description. URL is on the bottom of your screen. Hopefully, you guys, um, you know, uh, enjoyed the video. It's your boy GS, man, and we are out. Peace. Give it to me, baby.